What's up everyone? It's your boy, Kanye West, and you've just stepped into the vortex of creativity, controversy, and candid conversations. Welcome to Chatterbox. Today is Kanye's Corner, where we break down the walls of convention and dive headfirst into the deep end of culture, music, and life. Look, I know you've heard the headlines. Yeah, that's right. Kanye West sued for harassment by his ex-assistant. But let me tell you, there's always more to the story than meets the eye. We're gonna dissect it, analyze it, and maybe even drop a freestyle about it. Who knows? As we continue, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. Legal troubles mount for Kanye West as former assistant files harassment lawsuit. Kanye West, the influential rapper and fashion mogul, is facing a lawsuit from his former assistant, Lauren Pichotta. She has brought forth serious allegations against West, including sexual harassment, violation of contract terms, and unjust termination of employment. Pichotta's tenure as West's assistant lasted two years, during which she claims to have received sexually explicit texts from him and to have been subjected to his sexual acts over the phone. Her dismissal from the job occurred in 2022, and despite an agreement for a severance package worth $3 million, 2.4 million pounds, she asserts that it was not honored. The lawsuit came to public attention through TMZ and was subsequently verified by other reputable media outlets. Pichotta's professional background includes a period in 2021 when she was financially supporting herself through an OnlyFans profile. It was during this time that West engaged her for his Yeezy Women's Fashion Line project, and they also worked together on three songs from his Donda album. Although she is not officially credited on the album, this collaboration led to her being hired as West's personal assistant with a lucrative salary of $1 million, £780,000, per year, under the stipulation of her constant availability. In a turn of events in 2022, West allegedly insisted that Pishada terminate her OnlyFans account, offering an additional $1 million as compensation. Following her compliance, Pishada alleges that West's behavior escalated to sending her pornographic videos and engaging in masturbation during phone conversations with her. She also accuses him of masturbating in her presence within a confined space on his private aircraft. Pishada's promotion to chief of staff for West's companies was short-lived as she was terminated soon after in September 2022, without receiving the agreed-upon severance. Her lawsuit encompasses a range of accusations beyond harassment, including fraud, failure to pay wages, and deliberate infliction of emotional distress. This is not the first instance of West being accused of inappropriate conduct. Reports from last November revealed that during meetings at his Yeezy fashion line, he showed pornographic content and shared a personal photograph of his then-wife, Kim Kardashian. West has not publicly addressed these allegations. West's history includes his own admission of struggling with pornography addiction, which he has stated had a profound effect on his life from an early age. He has faced additional legal challenges this year, including a racial discrimination lawsuit from a former security guard at the now-defunct Donda Academy and a lawsuit for unauthorized use of a Donna Summer Song sample, which was settled outside of court. Despite his past success with chart-topping hits and a prolific music career, West's recent actions have led to significant controversy. His contract with Adidas was notably terminated following anti-Semitic remarks he posted on social media in November 2022. Thanks for watching guys. Leave your thoughts in the comments section below and please do not forget to hit the subscribe button and turn on notification bells.